Here, see if this is dry enough for you. What are you drinking? Same thing, straight. I was never one for girly drinks. Bond, are you there? Yes, Em. Right here. Nicole, do you mind if 007 and I speak privately for a moment? This is a need to know. Of course. No problem. We can talk. What did you find out? We've translated all the documents you photographed in Pomarov's office this afternoon. It appears that most of them were invoices for highly sophisticated chemical manufacturing equipment. They were to be delivered to a defunct chemical refinery he's recently brought back online in Siberia. Makes perfect sense. They tortured Tedworth, the researcher, for the code to his bio-research formulas. He was working on anthrax and smallpox antidotes for troops in the field, but they could just as easily be weaponized. That's what we're afraid of. No, that's what the whole world is afraid of. You've got to get there. Confirm what we think he's up to and stop him. Perhaps Miss Hunter can help you facilitate this. Yes, I'll talk to her. Good. Good luck, 007. You finished? I have to take a look at Pomerov's refinery in Siberia. Em thought you might be able to help facilitate things. I'm gonna need a flight, ground transportation, a local contact. Wait, wait, not so fast. I told Pomerov I'd get back to him about his business proposal. So, it's the perfect cover to get the two of us into the refinery. The two of us? M said facilitate, not the company. Well, how do you think I'm going to get you to Siberia? Oh, let me guess. A friend of yours owns a plane? May I speak with Rudolf, please? Why am I not surprised? <laughs> You're going to love it. It's got a shower, a wine cellar, and the most unbelievable circular bed. Yes, I'll hold. What? What's that look for? You'll be enjoying all that stuff alone. I'll be in the cockpit flying the plane. 